Today's vlog is going to be a bit different. I'm going to be doing a bit of a get to know me with my makeup tutorial. The makeup look I'm going for today is a simple everyday look, so enjoy! Firstly, I'm going to be using NYX. I just take a little bit and put it on my hand, as you can see here. Facts you should know about me. Why am I rubbing this in my face? I was born and bred in North London. So, um, yeah, I'm rough and ready like a North Londoner. But um, we're not all rough and ready. We're all diverse. I love that about London. Um, so that's all on my face. Next. We're going for foundation. So I'm using Estee Lauder. So it's a bit of a, mi a mixed match. And today I'm using Fashion Fair Pure Brown. Um, I also use MAC. And with this I don't, I don't mix, but with these two I do because Fashion Fair stick is a bit light for my complexion. And this, I don't like it by itself. Um, it has a red undertone um, that I guess could complement my face, but I think both together make it pop. So I'll be putting this on my face, so I'm gonna look a bit of a monster at the moment. I really do believe the trick to getting a really flawless finish um, is just blend, 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 blend. Um, and then when you finish blending, blend some more, so. Do you see how it's slightly darker on that side as opposed to this side? Oh, my passion for makeup, I met this amazing woman. Um, she was actually my, just a bit lighter than me when I was 19 years old. Um, she worked for Fashion Fair. I don't think she's there anymore. She looked amazing. Um, and I said, you know, I like your face, but I don't think I could look as nice as you. And she did my makeup. And the confidence boost it gave me at that time um, you've heard my story about being insecurities and growing up ugly. And if you haven't, then go back a few videos and have a look. Um, but I didn't have confidence in myself and it did give me a lot of confidence. Um, but now I don't wear makeup every day. Um, and the reason being because I learnt to appreciate my own skin and take care of my own skin. And that's what I'm more into now. Um, I do wear makeup when I'm going out and um, when I'm in the mood, you know, when you, when I feel like being Miss Glamour Puss, so I'll put on some makeup. Especially when my son's not around, I get, uh, I'll, I'll get out of the kit and just, I've got a lot of makeup. But yeah, she was amazing. She really showed me that, even though I don't use just fashion fair now, um, I use quite a variety of, of products, whatever complements my skin. But she just showed me that you can use makeup to create a vibe, um, a feeling, an energy that you want to create. I use it to complement what I already have rather than take over. So. I want my viewers to be inspired by the fact that you can express yourself, put it that way. Um, I think we spend a lot of time being dictated to by the media, by the world, how we should look. And I think we should express ourselves the way we feel in terms of how we, we look. Another perception I had when I was quite young was that um, because I'm dark, I can't find makeup for me. Only, only people of a certain complexion can have nice makeup. I felt like there wasn't much products out there for women of my my complexion, dark skinned women. Um, but as the years have gone, and I think that a lot of the companies that do produce beautiful makeup, um, yeah, a lot of the companies that do produce beautiful makeup are starting to say, let's get something out there for those dark beauties. <laughs> just started working from the darkest palette. Hopefully I'll have a shot for you. My motivation is you, the viewers. 
the views are my motivation to get up to do videos like this. Because there's some people out there I'm sure that don't actually use makeup. They probably just think there's no point. Or they might not even think that they are pretty enough to be able to do certain things. And I'm just showing you that I'm your average girl. Just simply your sincerely self. Just making something of what she's got. <laughs> And, you know, to some people, I may not look perfect, but I'm perfect to me. So, I just allow my perfections to shine. And I want to encourage anyone out there who doesn't feel perfect, that doesn't feel appreciated, that doesn't feel loved, you are. It's a big world, and even if you don't feel loved by the people you're with, you know, you are loved. It's a big world, you can find some other friends, find some other people that you can that can appreciate you for who you truly are so next I have this beautiful Sasha powder because if you haven't looked at the end of my videos I say I love doing life with you and um, that's what it's about before I started vlogging I was living my life in the shadows, uh, comfortable, happy, but safe. And I realised that when you have a voice and when you have a voice that has something to offer the world, don't live in the, in the, in the shadows. It's, you're robbing the world of something that is invaluable. They want what you have to offer. And so I realised that I had to give the innate wisdom, I'm a Christian, so I wanted to live out loud. I want people to see that we're not all the same. I'm unique, but most importantly, I wanted to impact the world in a positive way. I want people to feel hope when they watch what I do, and I want them to feel inspired. Um, I'm a mum, I'm a wife, I'm a businesswoman, um, I'm a friend, I'm a daughter, and I'm constantly trying to find the balance. Sorry, I'm starting to talk again. <laughs> I'm constantly trying to find the balance. It's all about doing life, living out loud, and, and impacting people in a positive way. That's why I do what I do. If I can save a life, if I can change a life, if I can help make a difference in someone's life, I've lived, I've done something right. Fashion Fair, this one is. Pure brown powder, okay? Your brown powder. I absolutely love singing. I was born a singer. I was born in a very musical family. Um, um, and to the level whereby they sing with celebrities and they are celebrities in their own right. Um, which I think is amazing. Uh, I sing and I write songs. So now I'm using this Embark eyeshadow. Um, I'm experimenting here, uh, but I really get quite a bit on there because I'm quite dark, so. We have Nip and Fab. Sleek. Bracket. Make sure you really blend out your makeup with a kabuki brush, add eyelash extensions and we're off. That's it guys, hope you've enjoyed this video, got amazing beauty tips and got to know me a little bit better. Till next time, goodbye!